Welcome back, ladies and gents, boys and girls, and everything in between. It's not bad to me. I really don't care today. Uh, what we are doing is we are going to inscribe this into Little Guy's workbench. And how we're going to do that is via a Craftsman Variable Speed Rotary Tool. This is... Uh, anyhow, this is something that I inherited. But, uh, ultimately, what we're going to do is we're just going to dive right on into it. And... Get her going.
All right, so now that the scribing is done, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab some sandpaper. And a beer, but we'll get over that. If you can kind of see that, uh, the grooves have soaked up some of the sand, well, some of the wood dust. So now what we're going to do, and yes, you are going to hear the compressor get over it, it'll be just fine. Now we're going to blow it clean. Now that we have blown it clean, we're shaking up some spray paint. And what we're going to do is we're going to spray in and let the spray paint fill in our grooves. Then what we're going to do is we're going to take Shop towel. We're going to wipe away the excess. And let it dry. Until uh, you know, once this is dry, then uh, the paint is going to settle down into the grooves, and then we're going to sand over and get rid of the excess paint, and have ourselves a wonderful little memento for little guy to have. Uh, this will be his workbench, and this will be his you know, it means something in 15, 20 years when he looks back on it, he can say, my dad built that, and it was for my first birthday. So, in the meantime, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to rotate you up nice and easy, hopefully. Up, oh, there we are. Oh, my goodness. And scoot you back. So, while we wait for that to dry, uh, again, this is just an, uh, an idea that I actually ended up doing on my own workbench when I first built it. So, uh, we're going to wait for this to dry, and it's actually probably pretty close. I mean, this is spray paint here. We're not, it's not a finish by any means. What it is, is more or less a memento for Little Guy. Um, so yeah, I don't know why I moved you all the way up here when I'm literally getting ready to sand it, so we're just going to knock it down a little bit. Oh, right around in there, that way you can see what it is I'm working on. So, um, that looks to be dry enough for me, so we're going to go ahead and... attempt to sand off 
the extra paint. If there's some left over, I'm really not going to sweat it because, again, this is just little dude's workbench, so it, it's not crucial that it looks perfect. What is crucial is that we have indeed inscribed his name into his workbench, well not his name, but at least the date that I built this on, uh, into his workbench, so he can have that as a reminder. Let's see what it looks like now. That is the general idea. We have actually inscribed his little message for him uh, so that I can personalize. Sorry guys, sorry, I really am. So that I can personalize his workbench. Now he has an actual Memento as opposed to just the the, the structure itself. Anyhow, uh, that's pretty much it for today guys uh, Thanks for watching like comment subscribe. Uh, we'll get to the tool giveaway here before long. I'm thinking I'm gonna run it for at least three weeks uh, So yeah, anyhow, uh, thanks for watching catch you guys in the next one